One of the important things about prototypes is that you want to make sure that the fidelity of the prototype is going to match what you get in production. Otherwise, you can't tell if the idea is bad or whether the prototype is just not really matching what you're trying to do. So when we use a method Excel, we know we're going to get great ABS parts that we can match in the injection mold. I'm Marco Perry. I'm one of the founders and partners here at Pensa, as well as the founder and partner of Pensa Labs. So we've been using Method ever since it came out. We used to have very large machines that cost us a lot of money to own and maintain. We started using the method, which allowed anybody to use it and it was not something that we had to track too tightly. So then when we started with the PLA machines uh, onto the ABS machines and now the XL machines, we were able to scale our production and also our prototypes. One of the benefits of having the XL here is that we can run a full batch of parts. We use this part on all of our machines, so knowing that we can run a whole batch of parts and have them all ready for us in the morning is really fantastic. Pencil Labs is now working on the, our new machine, the C64, which can bend and cut uh, in 3D a quarter inch material all the way down to a tenth of an inch. Some of the parts that we prototyped for the C64 are Tooling, we've tested a lot of the fits on tooling. And we have parts like this where we have our electrical harnesses going through a channel so the uh, ABS parts protect the wires. There's multiple ways we've saved time and money using Method XL. And the machine is working for us overnight, over the weekend, when we're not here. So it's actually doing a lot of work that we couldn't, and I get a part reliably every time. With the Method XL, we're using ABS and Rapid Rinse, and that's because it's so easy to use. The Rapid Rinse comes right off. We know we're going to get great ABS parts that quickly. We've been very, very happy with the parts in terms of surface finish, tolerance, accuracy, and repeatability, and we always get the same result.